Alright, so hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. And yes, this is what I look like barefaced with nothing on it at all, just moisturizer. <laughs> and I'm really want to apologize for the noise of chickens. It's probably gonna play throughout the whole entire video, and I'm really, 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 really sorry about that. But I moved to a new house. This is why I kind of, my setup like looks weird. I'm in the bathroom of my bedroom right now, and oh my god, even my hair is horrible right now, <gasps> bro. Okay, so I really wanted to film this get ready with me because uh, I'm late <laughs> for my modeling reunion. Actually, I have an hour to get there, and I have like a half hour to get out of my house because where I live, there's barely any Ubers circling the premises, so. It takes them forever to get here, apparently. I'm not sure. This is the first time I'm ordering an Uber to leave the house. And these chickens, man, I can't deal. But I'm, like, really short on time, and I have to leave soon. And, um, yeah, I don't, I barely have the time to get ready. And I barely know where my things are because, uh -huh, like I said, I moved. So all my things are still in boxes, which is why my hair looks like this. Because, as I've said since forever i don't know hair i just know makeup <laughs> so <laughs> please don't ask me for a hair tutorial because that's probably not gonna happen so first things first i'm gonna prime my face using some primer obviously on instagram you know that i do photography and runway modeling and i have to go to one of my modeling reunions right now especially since i missed last week so it's like uh -huh, by obligation i have to go today but I know you guys have been uh, wanting a get ready with me video for like a long ass time. But I never filmed it. So I'm going to film it today as I'm getting ready because, you know, this is raw footage. And, um, yeah, so I'm really, really late because uh -huh, I have four tan management skills. So this is really how I get ready whenever I'm late, which is <laughs> every day. Like, I thought I had good time management skills. I learned. I don't. I don't have the time to do a whole entire full face of makeup like I usually always do. And now my dog started snoring. That is great. Like I, this is horrible content quality. I'm so sorry that I am trash. As I was saying, I don't have time to do a full face of makeup. And usually, what I like to do is I just like to put some concealer, a little bit of foundation. If we got some, you know, problem looking skin. And some color to the face, a winged liner, and some lashes, and then that's that's it. I'm like good to go. So that's what I'm gonna do today. So this right here is my holy grail. I've been using this since I literally like started to use makeup when I was like 12, 13, outside my house instead of you know in my bedroom. <laughs> but sometimes Especially when I'm on the rush and I'm not doing like a lot on my eyes. I don't use concealer as primer and I used to use concealer as primer literally every single day. I didn't even care if I used like nothing on my eyes. If I wasn't doing a bold look or anything. But recently I just like started to switch back to this because it's really freaking good. And I remember how much I loved it. So I, yeah, I've been using this more again. Which is really freaking good. So, you already know, what is this? This is from Hard Candy Eyeshadow Primer. Good stuff. So everyone wants to live in a tropical island because they think like that's the way, but honestly, it's not when it is freaking hot as hell every single freaking day. And, you know, it's just not, it's not fun because bugs and like hotness and yeah, no. So I'm using literally a bronzer shade on my crease because I, I don't know, naked eyes to me kind of feel weird so I always have to have at least something in my crease. I'm just adding a little bit of highlight. Like I'm telling you, this is, this is literally how I do my makeup when I'm running late basically every single day. Like this is not... This is not a tutorial. Please do not take this serious. I promise I do makeup better than this and I will bring back makeup videos soon once I, you know, 
have a setup to place you guys because right now you're literally on this one shelf thing in the bathroom not the best looking wing but you know we're gonna work with it anyway that's what lashes are for to hide your mistakes but i honestly cannot live without a winged eyeliner and i used to have this problem that i try to pair a winged eyeliner with every single look i've made and in high school i was literally known for that i was known for hoop earrings and winged eyeliner every single day like i swear if i graduated in the u.s the yearbook would probably be like the one with winged eyeliner and hoop earrings every single day because that was my aesthetic and i still do it and i'm in college <laughs> Okay, can I make these even? That's the real question here. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to take the same bronzer shade that I put like right here in my crease and I'm gonna put it on the lower lash line. Nice. So let me go ahead and pop on my lashes and I'll be back. I'm back with some lashes and you see guys, lashes fix everything. Like seriously, it fixes all your problems. So yeah, you know, when you have an issue, just like pop these on and you're like all good to go. Like seriously, wise words from Kathleen Martinez. I think I'm gonna do that much foundation because I don't have the time. And plus I can't find my foundation. So I literally mix two different colors and just hope for the best. <laughs> wow, I feel like such a horrible makeup artist right now. Like this, this is not good. I'm really sorry, guys. I'm not perfect. Please don't judge me. Where is it? No. Oh, never mind. I'm actually not that late because it's. <laughs> I'm actually not that late because it's four, and it's at four thirty. But like I said, transportation is not the best out here because there's barely any Uber. So it's like if you don't have a car, you're kind of like screwed. And guess it doesn't have a car. Me, because it's been broken for like over a year now. One thing about time in the modeling industry is on time is late and early is on time. So <laughs> if you are a model and you're going to casting and the meeting is like at 3, you best believe you better be there by 2.30. <laughs> because that's how it is. And plus that's how it is in general, really, because like... You gotta be on time for things. Okay, I'm really sorry my camera like ran out of memory and I didn't have time to clear out the storage. So what I did was I put some contour. But I put some contour and then a little bit of blush and then some lips and then you know my classic earrings. Which I think really ties the outfit together. But yes, this is what I'm wearing. Usually when you go to modeling practices, modeling, casting, modeling, reunions or whatever, you're going to have to wear like black, but I'm not wearing black as you can see. But this is really loose fitting and you have to wear some leggings, black leggings is preferable, but yeah, that's basically how it is. If you want another video on that, I could do it like later, like in the far future. But that's pretty much it for now. So I gotta go because I'm really late. So I will see you guys on the next video. If you really like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys on my next video. Okay? Bye.